What is up ladies and gents, Hydra here with another Biss List Talents and Runes video. This time we're looking at Mage. First of all, we're going to look at the Biss gear. We're going to go through it really quickly. Keep in mind that the mindset again here is we're going to look for maximum stamina and intellect. So we're not going to be looking to get too much spell power as we're going to sacrifice way too many stats for that. So we're going to start out with the Lucky Fishing Hat. Next we've got Spectral Necklace of the Eagle, Sage's Mantle of the Eagle, Cutthroat's Cape of the Eagle, and then the Black Velvet Robes. You also have the option of the clam weave tunic here. Then we've got durable braces of the eagle. We've got laurel keeper's staff. There are, again, a few staves you can go for. They're all pretty good for mage. Rain call emits of the eagle. Gamura's cinch. Watch's leggings of the eagle. Extra planar spider silk boots. Seal of rin. Plains ring or just an eagle ring. Arena grandmaster. Insignia of the alliance. And then dancing flame. Now keep in mind, all these eagle items may be subject to change, depending on what BFD loot becomes available. There are a couple of specs that Mage can actually play in SOD for level 25 that are actually pretty viable, if not downright OP. The first of which is actually Fire. Here we're going to be taking 5 out of 5 Impact, 3 out of 3 Imp Fire Blast, 5 out of 5 Ignite, 2 out of 2 Incinerate, and then 1 out of 3 Ellie Precision because you get that 1% hit from the boots. You'll notice that I haven't actually taken Improved Fireball here, so in this spec, most of the time you're just going to be Scorching, Fire Blasting, and using Living Bolt. For the Frost Talents, it's relatively simple as well. We're just going to go 5 out of 5 Improved Frost Bolt, 1 out of 3 Ellie Precision, 3 out of 3 Frostbite, 1 out of 2 Imp Nova, 3 out of 3 Permafrost, Cold Snap, and then 2 out of 3 Imp blizzard now you again you only need one out of three in elemental precision due to the extra hit you're going to be getting on boots and then we're going to be taking two out of three improved blizzard so that it doesn't remove our cone of cold slow we're avoiding talents that benefit from crit generally because currently we're not able to get shatter due to lack of talent points for runes for fire on the chest room we're going to be running burnout early on we won't be able to get that much critical strike chance so burnout really helps with that and allows us to proc the ignites. Leg rune is just going to be icy veins. Very tough to beat this one. You have uh, potentially the option of living flame as well, but this doesn't look very strong. So icy veins is the clear winner. And then for the hand rune, it's got to be living bomb. There are no real other choices. Mage runes are relatively self-explanatory as each one is going to be one for arcane, one for fire, one for frost, and one for healing. For frost, the runes are just going to be fingers of frost, icy veins, and ice lance. These are all pretty much a no-brainer. There's not really that much choice to be had. They're all really, really strong, and I recommend you don't really deviate from this. 